Bamini, okay, the grammarian, okay. He was a Sanskrit grammarian and a scholar in in Sanskrit, okay. Yeah, this chap the, he going to be related in this chapter, okay? He prepared a grammar for Sanskrit, okay? Not only that, he arranged the vowels, okay, and consonant in a special order, and then used this to grab from a law, okay? Like those found in algebra, okay? He also you used this to write down the rules of language in short formula around 3000 okay of them okay around 3000 of them he wrote it in short formula okay Jainism okay Jainism Vartama Varma okay he was the last and 24 the Dangara of the Jains okay of the Jains okay let's study about his background okay he was a Kashriya brains of Lichavis, a group, okay, that was a part of Viji Sangha, okay, at the edge, okay, at the edge of 30, okay, he left home and went to live in the forest, okay, for 12 years, okay, he led a hard and lonely life, but at the end of which, okay, he attained enlightenment okay what were the doctrine okay what were the doctrine that he taught okay he taught in a simple doctrine okay that is man and woman who wish to know the truth must leave the home okay he was giving that simple doctrine okay not only that they have to follow very strictly the rules of i himself okay which means not hurting or killing living being okay all living being said mahavira okay long to live to all things life is there okay ordinary people could understand the teaching of mahavira and his follower because he used that simple language okay that is bhaktrit okay there were several forms of bhaktrit okay used in different parts of the country and named after the region in which they were used for example let's take an example the bhaktrit spoken in makata were known as makati okay followers of mahavira okay followers of mahavira they have to lead very simple life okay and and begging for food they have to beg for food okay they had to be absolutely honest okay especially ask not to steal okay they have to observe celibacy okay man had to give up everything okay including their clothes okay it was okay it was difficult for most men and women okay to follow the strict rule but still then okay thousand left their home to learn and teach his new way of life okay and many more remained behind and supported those who become monk and nun and provided them with food Jainism, okay, this was supported mainly by the traders, okay, compared to the farmers, okay, why do farmers, uh, between the far among the farmers, okay, why, it, why this was not popular is that farmer who had to guild and sex to protect their groups found it more difficult to follow the rules, okay, for, uh, for over hundreds of years, okay, Jainism spread to different parts of North India and to Kocharat, Tamil Nadu, and Karnataka, okay. The teaching of Mahavira, uh, of Mahavira and his followers were transmitted orally for several centuries, okay. They were written down in the form in the form in which they are presently available at a place called Valapi in Kocharat about 1,500 years ago.
Okay, the next one is the Sangha, okay? But, okay, how do I achieve the knowledge, okay? How do I achieve the knowledge? But Mahavira and Buddha, okay, feel that only those who left their home could can true knowledge, okay? They arrange, okay? They arrange for them to stay together in the Sangha and association, okay, of those who left the homes, there is also rule, okay? Rules were also made for Buddhist Sangha. Were written down, were written down in a book called Vinaya Pitaka, okay? From this, okay, we can to know there are several branches for men and women, okay? All men could join the Sangha, okay? Others have to take permission for joining the sanghas, okay? Children had to take the permission of their parents, slave to their master, debtor to the creditor, human to the husband's permission. Okay. What was the life of Sangha is that men, men and women who joined the Sangha led simple life, okay? They meditated for most of the time and went to cities and villages to beg for food during fixed hour. This is known as because, okay, in Bakrit word, it means renouncer or beggar. They taught others and helped one another. They also held meetings to settle any quarrel that took place within the Sangha. Who joined Sangha? Okay, the people. Those people who joined the Sangha are including Brahmin, Gashtras, merchants, laborers, barber, Kurdistan, and slave. Okay, many of them write down the teaching of the Buddha. Some of them also compose beautiful poems describing their life in the Sangha. The next topic is about the monastery. Okay, but Jen. Jen, Jen and Buddha, okay? Both Jen and Buddha, Buddhist monk, went from blessed to blessed, okay? From blessed to blessed throughout the year, okay? Throughout the year, teaching the people about their ideologies, okay? About their religions, okay? At the same time, okay? During that time, the only time they stayed in one place is during the rainy season, why is it that? Because during that time, okay, it was difficult to travel. Because of that, okay, therefore, their supporters, okay, build temporary shelter for them in garden or they live in natural cave in the hilly areas. Okay. Over the period of time, okay, many supporters of the of the monks and nuns and they themselves feel the need for permanent shelter, okay? Because of that, therefore, monasteries were built which were known as viharas, okay? The early viharas were made of wood and then of bricks, okay? Some of them were even in gaps that were dug out in the hill, especially in the western in India, okay? The land on which the Vihara was built was donated by rich merchants or a landowner or, or the king, okay? The local people came with gifts of food, clothing, and medicine for the monk and nun, okay? And in return, okay, they taught the people. Okay. A Buddhist text tells us, just as the water of river lost their name and separateness, when they flow into the mighty ocean, so are Varna and ranks and family forgotten when the followers of Buddha join the order of the monk. The system of ashram, okay? Jainism and Buddhism were becoming popular, okay? At the same time, okay, Brahmins also developed the system of ashram, that is, stage of life, okay? Four ashrams were recognized, okay? Were recognized. Brahmacharya, okay? 
Brahmacharya, Girhasan, Girhasta, Vana, Varna, Brasta, and Satyasa. Okay. Brahmacharya. Okay. This include Brahmins, Kshatriyas, and Vishas. Men were expected to lead simple lives and study the Vedas during the early during the early life okay and gehadas okay uh, they had to marry and leave his householder okay and after that vana vana brastanda okay that is they had to live in the forest and meditate okay sanyasin okay they had to give up everything okay the system of ashram allow men to spend some part of their lives in meditation generally women were not allowed to study the vita and they had to follow the ashrams chosen by their husband